Welcome combatants. So it seems we're going to get Titan Lee May as well. Don't know if this is coming the same time as Liu Kang, but Interloco has data mined it. So it is coming. But do like, subscribe, hit the bell notification, follow me to the future for more content. So, yes, as we know, the Liu Kang data mine of the Titan boss is officially going to be coming, whether it's this year or this month or not. But it seems this, yes, Interloco has obviously found something yet again as he's been data mining this game like crazy with these new updates and whatnot. So, yes, the one thing that's here now is this one which is Lee Mei's Titan boss and these are her animations that are showing up right now and you can see the moves that she's doing now this outfit of Lee Mei to me is one of the best outfits because it's one of the ones I was looking forward to and I'm so so glad that they put it in there because I thought where the heck is this outfit it was the outfit that showed up when Tanya was in her dark outfit and she fought against Liu Kang and Kitana of the hourglass now we have this Lee Mei's outfit actually here and her animations and you can definitely tell it's a titan boss because they extend their moves like they pull their moves back and they hold it and then they release so it's an ultra charge move which would have been which a lot more stronger than their normal move but this is good that we are officially going to get titan lee may as well with the outfit that looks awesome i'm so glad the, some of these outfits that they're giving some of these characters should never have been something that we have to wait down the line for they should have been already in the game and we have to either unlock them or when they come as a pyramid boss or whatnot the pyramid mesa should have already been there so when we get that mesa and we fight against them when they do show up we'll unlock those outfits of course you can use other crystals and unlock it but if you don't want to use that and pay for it that way you can just unlock it the normal way and i am honestly really glad that we are going to get um that version of lee may because she looks absolutely brilliant the lee may that we've got in the base game i don't like her outfit too much compared to this lee may this lee may's outfit looks absolutely phenomenal i love the way how it looks the the look of it the styling this is what the captain of the sundo police should have been wearing not the outfit that she wore which all of them are dressed in this is the sundo police outfit that she should have had i don't understand why ed boone and them like would have gone that route to go and give her just the uh, the average outfit that every other police member is actually wearing doesn't make sense it doesn't make sense to me at all it never has it's too much same thing same with tanya her outfit looks too similar to all the other ungadi they need to have separate type of outfits what look really good and look great for them so i'm thankful to interloco for even data mining this because this is another outfit that's going to look good i love the deadly alliance outfit she's got now that i have for her but this outfit just hits differently i think i like this more than the deadly alliance one so i am going to definitely be wearing this outfit a lot because this is definitely one of the things so i'm glad that we're getting the Liu kang titan bust the outfit looks really great but now we're also going to be getting the lee may one as well both of these outfits looks really good and i'm glad that we are getting these two outfits thanks to interloco data mining it but obviously let me know guys what do you think of this outfit can you not wait to fight against titan lee may what about titan Liu kang 2 are you glad that we're going to be getting all of these ones soon in the pyramid mesa but do like subscribe this is your boy future boy and about to future stay frosty peeps peace